Tom Aspinall here, this is our training day. This is the man who knows how to hit it all. And here we go, here we go. Oh. 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 Just doing a bit of uh, training, mate. A bit of what we're doing, Dad. A few knees and knees and kicks and stuff. Kicks and knees. Kicks and knees. Warming mate. up with a bit of grappling. But I'm constantly working on my kicks because I had the knee injury. I had the knee injury since I was like 17. So for a long time I couldn't kick, but now the knee's fixed. Getting the kicks right, but still pretty shit. But I'm working on it. Had that morning coffee, yeah? I thought you wanted coffee, yeah? What time is that? I'm about seven. Escapes the back, are they going to the top? Yeah. Then the person on on bottom uses the hook and grab. Yeah. Well, don't let them put the weight back down. Yeah, yeah. Keep the weight off. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. That was nice. Mindy's feeling for you putting the weight oh, down. Okay. Yeah. yeah. What are we looking at here, Andy? Uh, not getting stuck. <laughs> is, the, is the fear. Just don't get stuck on bottom. You get to here and she's going. Two hands go under. So I'll get both hands under. So I can just set up the pass. I'm sliding down. Uh, so both hands go under instead of one out there. Oh. Neil lost him. Yeah. Neil lost him then. With Tom at the moment, Andy, I like, am obviously not known his next opponent. Is it just a case of just con constantly improving him as a fighter as well? So it's about only thing that yeah, just getting better every day. So there's, there's nothing. There's no element that you can certainly focus on his art until he gets to fight camp. Uh, depending on the opponent, usually. Yeah. No. Yeah. Just get better in things that he would do. You know. Yeah, oh. Strong on Indy's hands are there, and he's got the strongest hand of anyone I've ever trained with, for or anything. It's ridiculous, but absolutely awesome training for me though. Hey, anyone who has ever grabbed is like, what the fuck is this? They're like, ridiculously strong hands. Awesome training partner, mate. Probably my favorite, one of my favorite training partners. Anywhere, maybe, of anywhere I've ever trained. Probably one of my favorite training partners. Wow. It must be pretty rewarding as well for you at the moment. Obviously, not not having an opponent, opponent, but just getting that, you know, improving as a fire all the time for you as well. Like your dad was just saying about it, that that's the most important thing. Hey, these are, I think a lot of fighters underestimate the time between fights. Like, you, you, your fight time is time to prepare for your opponent and get fit, but your improvements made, like, in between camps, and people underestimate that, I reckon. I reckon a lot of people just go, like, man, I'm training out for six weeks, eight weeks. You can't, you can't like, improve that much in between. Like you, you have to be dedicated every day of the year, so that's what I try and do. <laughs> Zoom in on that unfinished tattoo. But I got a, I'm having my, uh, my, my tattoos redone, obviously, because someone sent me a comment and it said, Tom Aspinall, 
had a fight with a tattoo artist and lost. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so I'm getting my tattoo read on. Force on that, Andy. Shouldn't have had me. I, 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 you know the best thing? You don't have any tattoos because I got tattoos. loads of bad ones and now I'm getting them all covered. So, <clears> the big. You know what? I didn't mind them. I have my back and I really like my back. And then my arms just look awful. So, I'm redoing my arms now. I'm going to see you, Bangle. Can I see it? Can I see you? You can't have Madison Square Gardens when you're on top of someone. <laughs> How big's the team at the moment as well? Um, I don't know, there's 11, I think, the other day, heavyweights. Today there's one, two, four, five, six, seven. So for the first two days, we usually do quite a bit. And then today, slower day, and then next day will be busy again. Friday will be slow. There's so many different aspects of it as well for Tom, with like from Mindy, even better. All the bodies yeah. are different. Yeah, they're all, they're all good for different, for different purposes, really. Just got to get them in on the right days. Yeah. We sort that out the weekend. And we, we work with that all week. I like this. Uh, what, what tune are you going for? So, I, I just like music on me. Any tune, sorry? The viral, the viral henky. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're missing it. Let's <laughs> get this off. What? There we go. That's all the notes out of those traffic <laughs> <laughs> How's that the tattoos? <laughs> these are quite, I had these a few weeks ago, but they're still a bit tender when he the noise you're making there, Mindy. Listen. Warm weather training in uh, St. Helens, so. Mm. Hotter than evolution. It is, isn't it? Smaller room though, there's no. Look at the ventilation in here. Loads of ventilation. Mm. It's not me, there's not even one window. Mind your head on the ceiling, Yeah, watch out, 
Rather walked, fights the dust. Uh, it's a technical one this morning they'll make. But uh, a couple of days, had a lot of heavyweights in this week, so a couple of days heavy grappling. Today's just a bit of a technical yeah. one. Just get some techniques in and then. But when you train, when you're a big guy, you can't, especially without a fight, you can't redline your body every day because you just end up injured. So it's like little elements, isn't it? Exactly. So today more technical. Tonight, a bit of strength and conditioning, light. Then tomorrow's Thursday, so tomorrow pretty heavy. Friday pretty heavy. Saturday pretty light. Off Sunday. <laughs> don't forget, like and subscribe. You don't have to if you don't want, but if you don't, you're missing out on a lot of good MMA shit. So make sure you like and subscribe.